When we're co-editing a worksheet in Excel, it is far too easy for a coworker to accidentally click into a cell that contains a formula and make a mistake that throws errors throughout the entire worksheet. Fortunately, there is a macro that can password protect only cells that contain formulas, and it is super easy to implement. Let's take a look at how that's done. In this spreadsheet, we have errors displaying throughout the entire F column. And it's likely that this column was created using autofill. That means that if one of our team members was co-editing this worksheet and accidentally clicked into cell F3, making a mistake that threw an error in that cell, it would also throw errors in the rest of this column. So let's first select a portion of this formula that we think might have the error within it. Then let's hit the F9 key. And we were right, here's the error. We can easily clean this up and that fixes all of the errors in the entire column. Now let's go to the developer tab and we're gonna click on the virtual basic icon. This pulls open a new window with a list of folders on the left. We're gonna click on module one and insert our VBA code here. We can then close out of this window and back in the developer tab, we'll click on the macros icon and run our new macro. We'll be prompted to enter our password. In this case, it's new password with a capital P. And now when we come back into this worksheet and we click on an empty cell, we can easily update the data within that cell. But when we attempt to edit the data within a cell that contains a formula, a message box pops up letting us know that the cell is locked and password protected. It's going to be much more difficult for someone co-editing the sheet to break a formula in the future.